Welcome back to my channel guys, Akar Nath Changan here and today I'm going to take you through an 8 minute workout which is purely based on planks. The workout is literally called I Love Planks. So basically through this workout we're going to be doing variations of planks which will work on your core but also your upper body and legs. So we're going to be doing a commandos, we're going to be doing push up to planks instead of commandos, we're going to be holding planks, we're going to be doing a side plank leg lifts so many variations just to help you improve your stability your core strength and also your coordination and balance so this workout is going to be a little slow there's no cardio associated but what i want you to do is focus on a mind to muscle connection really feel those muscles working because that is how it is actually going to help you improve help you improve your posture, your core stability, your back stability as well. So this workout is great for all of those. And you don't need any equipment with this one. We're doing this only for eight minutes and there are no repeats, which means each exercise we're gonna be doing only once. But feel free to repeat this workout twice, maybe thrice to get in a full workout if you feel like, okay, it's not enough. I am putting this workout up as a finisher for you to do after your main workout. But if you feel like you want this to be a main workout, Go ahead and repeat it twice or thrice. It will work really well and it will be really effective. But I really do hope that you enjoy this workout. If you do, do not forget to hit that thumbs up button and hit that little bell at the bottom because there are more workouts and videos, fun little videos coming your way on my channel. And you can also check out my Instagram for further tips and tricks about fitness and nutrition to just make it a simple, sustainable, healthy routine for you. Now enough chatter, let's get going. We'll get started on the mat. All the exercises are gonna be on the mat. So just find a soft surface or get yourself a mat and let's do this. Okay, now I do have two phones, one for music and one for the timer. So this is how it's going to work. We're gonna be doing each exercise for 30 seconds with no breaks. We have four circuits, four exercises in each circuit, all right? So the first thing we're gonna get started off is with a high plank. Now I will talk, talk to you about the form before getting started with the workout. So in a high plank, these are your form checks. Make sure that your wrist is directly below your shoulders. So you want to step back into that plank, feet shoulder width apart. Make sure those knees are straight, try not to have soft knees. Make sure those knees are straight. And instead of letting your shoulders fall, push the ground away from you, squeeze those glutes, tighten that core, have a slightly rounded back. I don't want to see this or this slightly crunch in your core here, all right? So this is how we're gonna stay, elbow straight, knee straight, and really crunch it in. That's gonna really be effective, guys, so that's really important. You guys ready? In three, in two, in one, let's go. Holding it here, nice, high plank, push the ground away. Now this, your modification is given there, you can drop your knees, really crunch in that core, it's just not this, crunch in that core if you're doing the modification. Ten seconds. We're gonna switch into a forearm plank after this. Three, two, one. Coming down onto your forearm. Same thing. Try not to fall down onto your shoulders. Push the ground away. Knee straight. Squeeze those glutes. Option to drop your knees for a modification. Each exercise is literally only for thirty seconds, guys. So don't give up and we're doing each exercise only once. So give it your all. We're going into planks to push ups after this, the commandos. You can do the same thing on your knees as well for beginners. Three, two, one, let's go. Coming up, high plank to a low plank, alternate your arms. Start with your left the second time. Whew, my arms are shaking. Coming up and down. Same thing on your knees. Good job. 10 seconds. Keep going. 4, 2, alright coming up into a high plank, slow mountain climbers. Right knee to the chest, out left knee to the chest, out beginners, one knee down, crunch in and out, I'll tell you when to switch. Keep going. Ooh, baby. Beginners switch legs. So now your right leg comes down, in and out. Rest of you slow mountain climbers, come on, you got a break after this. Crunch in that core and 
relax. All right, that's just your rest period. We're gonna switch into a side plank next, all right? So just holding a four arm side plank on one side in eight. 20 seconds break in between each circuit. We're getting into circuit two. In three, two, one, let's go. I'm gonna show you variations. You can drop in, drop one knee and hold it this way or both up or one leg forward to give you a little bit more balance. Steady, hold it there. Pulling in that core, we're working on those obliques. Again, modify if you need to. You can hold a side plank, keep your leg lifted, keep your leg down, whatever works for you. Watch your form. Three, from there we're going into side plank twists. Let's go, hand goes up. You're gonna twist and back. Twist and back. Exhale on the twist, inhale up. Again, modification, same thing with the knee down. Twist and up. Twist and up. Keep going. 10 seconds. 5, 2, and 1. We're switching to the other side. You can just turn around. I'm, I just don't want to show you my back. Side planks on the other side. Come on, guys. Steady. We're almost there. Again, use the modifications if you need to. In two, one, twist it up. Come on, last one for the circuit and then you get a break. Good job. Almost there. Whew. All right, break it. We're coming back into a forearm plank now, guys. We have our step outs here. So we're coming into a forearm plank, just X toe taps. So stay in that plank, crunch at that core, right leg goes up. Left leg goes up. Beginners try as much as you can or just hold a plank for me. If you can't step it up, just hold that plank. Woo. Again, make sure you're squeezing those glutes. The next one's a little hard. We're gonna come up into a high plank. Three, two, and one. Coming into a high plank. This time, right hand, right leg step out in. Left hand, left leg step out in. Come on. Right, left. This one's tough. Whew. It's all about those planks. If this is too hard, on your knees. Step in. Step in. But keep that core tight. Come on. Five. Three. Two and one. All right, coming on your forearms again. We've got forearm mountain climbers. So pike it in, pike it in. Slight pike on the forearms here. Come on guys, one more exercise. Who my shoulders. This time, in a high plank position, we're gonna step it up. Again, if this is too hard, just hold the plank for me, guys. You guys got this. Come on, I know those shoulders are feeling it, but just step it up. We're going back into a side plank series after this. Just one more circuit. Two, and one. All right, last one. We're coming back into a modified side plank this time. All right, so on a high plank, we're gonna stay here, just crunch it out. So both legs down, hands up, feel the stretch, exhale crunch, inhale up. In two, 
One, let's go. Crunch and up. Option to keep your leg lifted if you want those glutes to work a little bit more. Keep that core tight. If you keep your leg lifted, your glutes will work too, but it's totally okay to drop your legs. Come on. Five. This is your last circuit. And one, we're staying there. Now hands come to your hip. Flex that toe all the way forward, point it all the way back. If this is too tough, crunch it in. Come on, flex that toe all the way forward, point all the way back. Your glute on the base leg is working here. We're gonna switch to the other side after this, guys. Five. Two. And one. We're switching to the other side. Again, you can just turn around, side plank crunches, let's go. Really stretch, feel that stretch. Good job, option to keep that leg lifted. We're almost there, do not give up now, 10 seconds. Three, two, and one, staying there, lifting that leg. Flex, point, and all the way back. Remember, modification is to just crunch it here. Even that works on your side abs too. But remember, I want you to focus on the form. Come on, last 15 seconds. Point, and back. Flex, forward, point, and back. Last seven. Whoo, my glutes. Two, and one. You guys are done. Good job guys, I hope you enjoyed this workout. Like I said, this one's only 8 minutes. Especially if you're doing it after an upper body or if you like me have sore glutes. I did a lower body yesterday and I still find it sore. You'll know that this is a lot harder than it looks. But again, like I said, you can repeat it twice, maybe three times just to get in a more effective workout and see, feel it really in your core. I hope you really enjoyed this workout. Let me know in the comments below if you did. And I will see you in the next workout. And do not forget to hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps me out and I appreciate it. Thank you. Love you. Bye.